All right, guys, 2018 is just around the corner, so that means it's time for a brand new music library directory. This is the 2018, if you can see that, uh, version. So I just released it. It's below in the link below in the description. Uh, we've actually added a lot more uh, libraries and companies to this year's edition. Last year, we had over 200, which was plenty. Um, but some of them in this industry, things go out of business. People go out of business, they get bought out by other bigger libraries. So it's a very fluid industry. Some people just stop doing it and their websites go defunct. So a lot of those were sort of uh, updated, taken out, and a lot more were added actually. So there's been some new companies that have come on board. Um, and so now there's actually over 300 companies that are here and it's massive guys. I don't even know if you can see I mean, you can kind of just see that there are just tons and tons and tons and tons of companies, okay? So you can go uh, do your own research and spend days, weeks, months trying to find these people, um, or you can have them all in one place. It's still 47 bucks, same price. You're getting actually more than you got last year. Um, all the members of the syndicate get automatic updates, so this is all included in their membership. Um, but if you're just wanting to sort of uh, do, it, do it yourself, you know, go out there and shop your own music and try to get your own uh, tracks under contract. This is a great, easy way, fast way to basically start doing your research. You do need to do your research again um, and not just uh, do a spam uh, operation where you just throw your music out to like, you know, all 300 companies that will ensure you pretty much don't get accepted by everybody and you're gonna be listed on sort of like a blacklist or they're just gonna put your email in spam. So you need to have a targeted, uh, definite pitch when you do submit to them. Um, but I list everything in here from stock uh, libraries, royalty-free libraries, to TV film libraries, which I obviously do more recommend. Um, the reason why I include the royalty-free stuff and the stock stuff is because I know people who do make decent money with those websites. So it, would be, um, it wouldn't be serving you guys well if I just sort of didn't include those because I thought that they weren't worthwhile or something because I know they can actually get you paid. And if you're maybe in the beginning stages of your career here and you're not finding a lot of uh, acceptance letters from libraries, maybe going into other avenues might be a useful way to just get started to start bringing some income in um, as well. So I think, it could, you know, any way that you can make money with your music, you know, take the path of least resistance. So I do include a wide range, all the way including up to, you know, top of the line trailer houses, ad agencies, all that kind of stuff. So there's a lot of stuff going on uh, in this directory. Um, you need to do your research. I'm not here to do the research for you, okay? I've compiled all this information. It took a long time to do that to make sure this stuff was all accurate, up to date, the links worked and all that kind of stuff. Um, I've even been paying people to do this research and to go out there and, and find all these companies because uh, I just literally don't have enough time these days. Um, but I definitely have verified uh, as much as I possibly can to make sure this is legit stuff. Um, if you ever do find something that you're like, hey, Jesse, this this library went out of business, it'll happen, you know, probably like in six months or something. Uh, maybe, you know, if you don't get to it right away, uh, you'll find that something went out of business. Always let me know. You can always email me, comment, whatever, uh, get at me so that I know I can take it out for either the next year's version or if there's a lot of them, you know, in it right in the row and they're happening really quickly, then I can just basically do a quick revision or a quick update for you guys because I want to make sure you're not clicking on dead links and finding companies that are sold and out of business or they just sort of dropped off the face of the earth and who knows what happens. Um, it's a fluid industry, so it does happen. So again, you can get it with the link below. It's right here and you'll get instant download to it. It's a, it's a PDF and you'll instantly get it. Um, you can click on it and download it right there and start doing your research uh, immediately. So really cool things are happening. Um, on Wednesday of this week, I will be posting a group chat that I had with uh, fellow syndicate members and we talked about uh, some of our achievements, uh, the, pretty much their achievements, what they accomplished this year being a part of the group, as well as what they want to do next year, including how I can improve my services for them. So um, I'm going to release that to you guys here uh, on YouTube. Most of our chats that we do in the syndicate, I don't post them publicly, but this one I sort of gave them a heads up. Hey, I might want to put this one out on my YouTube channel. So you guys are going to kind of see us actually interact and how we talk and um, you know what the vibe is like basically on the inside of the group. So it was a really cool chat. It got me really, um, it gave me a lot of good feedback for how to even be more useful uh, to you guys moving forward into the next year, uh, as well as um, how I can basically specifically target some of the homework assignments and, uh, and assignments that I'm doing, maybe even some of the opportunities if I can control some of that to help more members achieve their goals, whatever their goals are. And again, there's goals ranging from just trying to get, you know, better sounding tracks to need to get first uh, a, new, a first contract with a library to, um, you know, whatever, need to build up the royalty base or something. Like there's, there's, you know, everybody's at a different point in their career. So it doesn't matter what your goals are. I would like to be somebody that can help you 
um, it push you a little bit into getting closer to those goals. And so that's what this chat was really all about. So you guys will see that on Wednesday. I hope you enjoy it. It's about an hour long. So, um, but I think you're going to get a lot of value out of it. I know that I definitely revealed a few, I think the just million dollar tips, million dollar ideas, really useful things um, that'll instantly uh, supercharge your production skills, including a sort of secret technique that I've used. Uh, I, I used it way, you know, many uh, years ago, and I need to do it more often. But um, it's basically a way for you to actually uh, get mentored by your favorite producer or artist absolutely free. You don't have to pay a dime for it, and you can actually get a mentorship uh, session with your favorite producer or artist, anyone, Michael Jackson, the Beatles, doesn't matter who it is, you can get an absolutely um, a free mentorship session uh, from them sort of in a way not obviously directly they're not going to be in your studio but there's a really cool way that you can do that and learn from uh, some of the best and the best to make sure that you are uh, always stepping up your production and trying to get on their level so look out for that that's coming on wednesday